Hello everyone. Today we are going to discuss how to find the cup surface area, total surface area and volume of the combined solid with the help of an example. Let us see one example here. We have to find the volume, cup surface area and total surface area of this given solid. First of all, this solid contains two objects here. It is the combination of the two objects, cylinder and a cone. Uh, for this, what are the parts given here? Let us determine them. Okay, this uh, in cone, this 10 centimeter is given here. What this 10 centimeter is? 10 centimeter, it is the slanting height. Yeah, slanting height is denoted by L. It is 10 centimeter given and what is the radius of the cone given radius of the cone is also given here uh, this 12 centimeter is the diameter of the circular base of the cylinder and here the base of the cylinder and the base of the cone are same that is the radius of the cylinder and radius of the cone are same so radius of the cylinder radius of the cone is diameter divided by 2 which is 12 by 2 is equal to 6 centimeter 6 centimeter is the radius okay in this cone here we may see these are the parts of the cone this is the radius this is the vertical height or actual height and this is the slanting height it is the right cone so this will be perpendicular here so by using the Pythagoras theorem here, L square is equal to R square plus H square. So using L square is equal to R square plus H square, we get 10 square is equal to 6 square plus H square. By solving this, we get H is equal to root of 10 square minus 6 square, which is equal to 8 centimeter. So the height of the cone, vertical height of the cone is 8 cm. Now all the variables, there will be only 3 variables in the cone. All the 3 variables are obtained in the cone. And in the cylinder, this 20 cm is the length of the cylinder or it is height of the cylinder. Height of the cylinder is not and radius of the cylinder is also not. So in cylinder, radius and height are both are not. Means all the variables which will be used to find total surface area, cup surface area and volume of this combined object are obtained. Now let us find the volume. Okay, to find the volume of any type of combined object, we find the sum of the volume of the ob different objects. Here cylinder and cone are combined here, so we will find the volume we will find the volume of cone plus we will find the volume of cylinder then the sum of these two volume will be the volume of this combined solid so volume of the cone is 1 by 3 pi r square h plus volume of the cylinder we have formula it is pi r square h so let's put the value 1 by 3 times 22 by 7 times r square is 6 square times h this h means the height of the cone height of the cone is 8 here plus pi means 22 by 7 times r square means 6 square times h this h means the height of the cylinder it is 20 given times 20 so it is equal to here in both the places h is written here but these yachts are not same, so we may differentiate them by 1 and 2. Here, 1 by 3 pi r square yachts. This is the formula of cone. So, height of the cone should be written here. Height of the cone is 8. Pi r square yachts is the formula of the cylinder. So, this yachts means the height of the cylinder. 20 we have to write here. Radius are same. We have already discussed. Radius of the cone and radius of the cylinder are same since they are on the same base. Okay, let us uh, calculate this.
equal to 2262.86 which is equal to plus 301.71 is equal to 2564.57 and it is the volume so the unit of the volume will be cubic centimeter so it is cubic centimeter is the required volume here okay now let us find the cop surface area cop surface area is also the sum of the cop surface which are combined there here cone and cylinder two objects are combined so cop surface area of this combined solid is equal to cop surface area of the cone it is pi r l plus cock surface area of the cylinder it is 2 pi r h so it is equal to okay let us put the value is equal to pi r l pi means 22 by 7 times radius means 6 times l means slanting l slanting ideal 10 centimeter given times 10 plus 2 times 22 by 7 times R radius is 6 times height of the cylinder is 20 times 20 okay it is equal to let us calculate this 22 times 6 times 10 divided by 7 is equal to 188 0.57 plus uh, similarly another 2 times 22 times 6 times 20 divided by 7 divided by 7 is equal to 754 754.29 which is equal to nine hundred forty two point eight six it is the area so unit of the area will be square unit and the units are given here centimeter so square centimeter is the required cop surface area now let us find the total surface area okay to find the total surface area in the case of volume we find the volume of the different object and eight we can get the volume of the combined solid in the case of cop surface area also how many objects are different objects are combined there of this different object we find the cop surface area separately and if we add them then we can get the cop surface area of the combined object but not like is that in the cop surface area to find the total surface area we find the cop surface area plus area of the plane surface if any so total how many surfaces are here this cop surface of the cone this one surface cop surface area of the cylinder this surface and area of this circle this is the another surface so all together three faces three surfaces are here so we will find the sum of these three surfaces which will be the total surface area remember it total surface area of any combined object is not the sum of the total surface area of the different object used there to form a combined solid this is important thing to note so to find the total surface area cop surface area plus cop surface area second plus plane surface area we can do this okay let us do total surface area of this combined solid is pi r l plus 2 pi r h plus cop surface area pi r l cop surface area of the cylinder 2 pi r h plus this plane is also one face here so it is pi r square now area of the, all the surfaces we obtain here which is the total surface area now keeping the value here it is 22 by 7 times 6 times 10 
plus 2 times 22 by 7 times 6 times years is 20 height of the cylinder plus 22 by 7 times 6 square okay this we have already calculated it is 188.57 Plus this is 754.29 plus uh, 22 times 6 square, 22 times 6 square divided by 7 is equal to 113.14. 113 and their sum is 900. 113.14 is equal to 1055 1055.64 and it is also the area so unit of the area will be square unit and cm square so this is the total surface area of the combined solid so that's all to find the volume cup surface area and total surface area of the combined object okay, in this way by using the same concept we can find the total surface area cup surface area and volume of the combined object remember this to find the volume of the combined object we find the volume of the different object and we sum them to find the cup surface area also as in the volume we do the same and to find the total surface area, cop surface area plus plane surface if any we do to find the total surface area and this formula you have to uh, note, you need to remember this formula. Okay, thank you for watching our video. If you like the content, you may subscribe our channel. Thank you very much.